What's up everybody? Welcome to another little short video from AWC Diaries. Today we've got a really cool video for you that shows not only the intelligence of elephants but the fact that they can be camera shy too. This video took place when I was filming for my movie Last of the Big Tuskers in Amboseli National Park which is a really beautiful national park in Kenya. We were trying to film a particular elephant named Tim who sadly passed away earlier this year in 2020. He's protecting the big bull. Tim, where's Tim? Where's Tim? Just on the right of that. He was a magnificent super tusker with ivory in excess of 100 pounds a side. He had what are called Ascaris or guardians with him. He had about five or six of them. And these are younger elephants that guide him through the last years of his life because he was a very old elephant. On a daily basis, they used to leave the boundaries of Amboseli National Park and head out into the villages to raid the maize fields. And because Amboseli is not fenced, very easy for these elephants to come and go as they please. And so we knew the exact path that Tim and his naughty Ascaris would take to go out into the villages. And so we decided to set up two GoPro cameras on either side of the elephant path so that we would get the elephants walking in a straight line one after the other as they do on that heavily trafficked path. So we thought, okay, our plan's gonna go perfectly because these cameras are so small, the elephants will never see them. So we set them up next to the path and we moved off in a Land Rover and sure enough, Tim and his cohorts started moving down that well-traveled path and then the craziest thing happened. As that leader Scari comes to within, I would say, about 20 feet or so of the cameras, he lifts his trunk and he starts sniffing the path with his trunk. And you can actually see him in both cameras looking dead on at the cameras. He deviates and the other elephants follow him. He goes off the path and they come behind the cameras. And it's almost as if he knows that cameras can only film you from the front. First, one of the elephants picks up one of the GoPros, puts it in his mouth, and if you've ever wondered what the inside of an elephant's mouth looks like, this is it. And then you can see another elephant comes around and picks up the other camera, and they start moving off. They're chewing the cameras. You can see one of them eventually drops the camera and plays football with it and kicks it. And you can see all the elephants, one after the other, walking over the camera. Okay, of course it's not the best footage because it's covered with elephant slime and gob and dirt. This was the craziest thing to watch because I'm sitting on the Land Rover with our guides and thinking, oh my gosh, we've just blown our last two GoPro cameras. They've eaten them, <laughs> they've swallowed them. We're gonna have to follow these elephants for I don't know how long to hopefully get the GoPro cameras one day from their poop, thankfully. They spat them out about 200 yards down the path. Wow. <laughs> and, and he ate our camera. <laughs> what happened here? <laughs> what happened here? Me too. Me too, the camera. <laughs> this, to me, just demonstrates that elephants are so similar to us in so many ways. They've got incredible memories. They can remember anything from 20, 30 years ago, something that happened to them. They'll remember that. And they also show emotions like we do. They've got this strong, incredibly strong social fabric. Mothers look after their babies for years and years, just like us. They also have self-awareness. If you show an elephant a mirror, 
and you paint a dot onto its face, it'll wipe that dot off its face. And this is behavior that is only known in the higher primates, the cetaceans, which are whales and dolphins, ourselves, and in elephants. Elephants are just so similar to us, amazing creatures. I really hope you've enjoyed this little brief video that shows not only are elephants camera shy, but they are curious, they have a sense of mischievousness, and they are incredibly intelligent. If you've enjoyed this video, I hope that you'll stick around and watch our next video on AWC Diaries because you just never know what you're going to find when you get out into the wild.